Proudly wearing red, white, and blue, United States history classes at Bluffton High School are celebrating Constitution Day and Citizenship Day today. All right, today on Constitution Day. On this day, September 17th, 1787, our founding fathers signed the document in Philadelphia. I think it's important that we celebrate it every year as a U.S. history teacher. Uh, our last unit was the Constitution. I feel it's a nice way to get the kids more involved, to show them, even though we don't celebrate it nationally as much as we should, to sort of do it locally. Students say learning about the Constitution allows them to understand their rights and how the government operates. The Constitution is the very basis of the entire U.S. government and is the whole like operating of it all. And so it's important to know that so we know how our government works and know how to protect ourselves from various injustices we might receive. The first 10 amendments are the Bill of Rights, so it's kind of nice to know like what we have as um, social liberties in a way and just understanding what we as Americans like get to go by, I guess, and like just understanding the law because otherwise like we can't really practice what we don't understand. Throughout high school, students will continue to learn about the Constitution and their social studies courses. They have rights and these rights are given to them by the Constitution and they can't be taken away. Way. And as we talk about voting and the expansion of suffrage to African Americans, then to women, you know, then to 18 year olds, that I want them to vote. And I, I'm, I'm proud that I vote in every election. I want them to be civically minded citizens. In 2004, Congress passed a law designating today as Constitution Day and Citizenship Day. At Bluffton High School, Ron Lopes, Beaufort County School District.